Neil, congratulations. Playoff spot secured with a game to spare. Proud. Proud, proud and understatement. I've just got a, a bit emotional with the lads here because when I come in, we were tipped to struggle. People tipped us to go down. And then what they've done, what they've done there is, is absolutely phenomenal. They should be so, so proud of themselves. They've gave us everything. I mean, we've lost Dylan after, what, 15, 20 minutes a day? We've lost Isaac Rice. It's a disgrace for someone to... I'll, I'll get on the referee in a minute, no doubt, but it's a disgraceful chance on him. He's, caught, he's jelly legged, he's concussed. I've got Harry Lewis left back, I've got Joe West centre half, we're backs to the wall, lads who are on the, out of the legs. And, and the way they battled and dug in at a tough place, really tough place to come, it, it epitomises what they're all about as a group. They've backed each other all season, we've backed them, they've backed us, um, and I'm so, so proud. And despite having all those changes that you've had to make to patch things up, so to speak, We've had chances to win the game as well. Yeah, I thought we had the best two chances. They've scrambled two off the line. But I think if we're a bit more clinical, we score them. But I'm not going to grumble today. You know, I'm going to get back on that coach. I'm going to have a nice glass of wine and I'm going to enjoy it. Enjoy it. Because it, once once next week's out of the way, that's the end of the league for me. We will be in the top five best teams in this league, which is a phenomenal achievement. But then that's packed because then we go into a new competition. I always say the playoffs are a completely different competition to the league. And, that, and that's what it is. So we'll look back in the league campaign with, with pride um, and then we go into a new competition um, a week on Tuesday. What do you think the biggest thing you can take away from this season is that you've learnt, really? <laughs> so much. It was a learning curve for me. Look, at it. I'm fresh in the job. I think recruitment's been good. I think you look at the characters I've got in the loan, lads have absolutely gave us everything. And sometimes I can go the other way. They just they come in and they don't want to get... Uh, really involved or they read for their own reasons where I look at Kirst the Rose, Aaron Lewis, Ty, phenomenal. The lads we've signed have got a for the right reasons. They all want to progress in the careers and kick on and I want to help them do that. And then we've obviously got Clay Donald's and the old man up front who's who's an absolute credit to himself. How he prepares even at this you know he, that, that's what I, I believe I was brought in to do last season, be that voice in the dressing room and, and, and I know Clay and I know his character and legacy, the way he, he, he acts after games, the way he prepares for games. The other lads see that, the other lads see it and if they want to go and have careers in the games there's no one better to learn off. So he's been a massive part of it, the staff behind the scenes, Jamie Gunno, Stampy with since he's come in, absolutely phenomenal. You know, it, it's a group, we're, we're very grounded, we're very humble, we know we are not as maybe got as much money to throw around as as everyone else, but we, we, everyone I've got on, my, on that side, graphs like that for this football club and the chairman just coming in. So he, he should be very proud of the of the team and the squad we've got. But like I say, we'll we'll celebrate on the way home. We'll enjoy a couple of drinks, and then we um, like I say, it's new competition um, a week on Tuesday. We will we want to win next week because obviously if we, if we can't finish second, I don't know what the league is, and I want to finish third. If we can't finish third, we want to finish fourth. We want to beat FC next week and then we'll, we'll see what comes Tuesday. But now, nah, phenomenal this season. Uh, you know what some of the stuff that the kids that have been involved here uh, doubt is. And it's, 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 uh, it's, I love I lo used to love it as a player. I used to love proving people wrong. And that squad's proved a lot of people wrong with uh, the season they've just had. Exactly. Backs against our walls. We come out fighting. We prove people wrong on a week by week basis. And yeah, and it, like I said, it, 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 today <laughs> it was the slowest clock I've ever seen. Um, but the lads dug in, defended the, 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 the goal mouth unbelievably well, unbelievably well. And I don't think they had a chance. Yates come and done, dealt with some crosses and done superb. And then, like I said, the way we've broken the energy to, to get up the pitch up this hill and create the two best chances of the, of the second half. Fantastic. Like I say, I'm, I'm not usually lost for words, but I'm getting there now because, like I said, they've given, not, not me everything, they haven't given me everything because it's not about me. They've given this football club everything and they're a credit to themselves and the family of this group. Well, congratulations, Sabish. Enjoy your night, enjoy the celebrations, and we'll Cheers, do it all man. again. Thanks, mate. Cheers, Bish.